Look, we're here. I want to mount him. But in reality, maybe I just want to make him uncomfortable, okay? Because here, I want to mount here. He's going to fight me on it, okay? Maybe I'll go here, 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 here. Maybe I'll go back. Maybe I'll go back here. <laughs> maybe I'll go back here. Do you notice how you just roll and roll and roll and roll? The thing is that I don't want to be like, I want to go from out this way, and that's the only way I'm going, and you're going to block me that way, and I'm going to go <clears throat> like that. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Oh, <laughs> you're ready to get this Okay, so you gotta think of it. This is one option to mount, but you still can walk around the head. And it's you don't have to walk all the way around the head. You just kind of get diagonal because your mount or your your side should never be at a right angle. It should always be at, at a cross, like a like a more of an X versus a right angle. Okay, so it should be here. Okay, because the second that you guys do this, as most everybody does. I don't control this hip. Walk your hip away, put your knee in the bottom. I'm losing the half guard. I mean the uh, side control, okay? Very no bueno for me as they say in Canada, okay? So here, I want to be dynamic because it's my hips because he's also trying to improve his position. And his position of improvement typically is going to be a half guard. It's not going to be a full guard recovery or it's gonna be a half guard, or it's gonna be an underhook. So I have to watch both. That's why I'm keeping my elbow to his hip, so I can control his hip, deny him an underhook, okay? Force him to now have to figure out how to disconnect his hips from me in order to frame away, while me, I have to keep in mind, he wants a half guard. So as I'm here, I, and I gotta control his head too, okay? So as he starts moving, okay? I, I, if, I, if I do this, he'll get a half guard. So I shouldn't do that, okay? So, and I move my hip, I move my knee away, look. And I roll here, here, another, look, he went here, went here, went here, look, went around the, another way, we're here. So now, we're, he's facing it, but I'm still got side control. He's not recovering half guard, okay? And I guarantee you in this exchange, he's spent more energy than I did. Now what if I just keep doing that to him, okay? Before I even submit, because look, I kind of have a key lock here. I have this control here, okay? So from here, let's say, maybe I want to go this way. Look, I'm already here. Maybe I'll go this way now. Here. And we get to maybe this position here, okay? But you notice that He's getting worn out, I'm using less energy. If I keep doing this, his energy will go low, 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 low. Mine will stay here. If I breathe, I can be up here, no problem, okay? So, uh, when you head that way. Uh, you have an underhook. Your hip is rolling into him. And notice how my foot is out, so I can drive laterally, and I'm feeling his hip. Okay, but I'm also here. I'm either controlling his head. Why? So it's harder for him to turn into me. Turn into me? It's harder for him. It's harder for him to use this frame to frame my head away. Frame it away? It's harder. I can control the arm. Turn into me? Okay. Now from here, you slide your knee forward. Okay. And you have the scarf here, you have the arm here. At the tricep and you're pinching okay and you're pulling and your right kind of floating rib is on his rib okay technically that should be off the mat okay right here okay talk count one two three four five okay what you're gonna do is this your feet okay you're gonna move this foot back and you're gonna look away and you're gonna step over the head Okay. Your elbow pinches and your hip moves in. Okay. Notice how my head had to go away? Okay. Come on. Here, here, here. I got that arm. Slid through. 
to which my feet, because that right one is pushing, that right one, and pushing me up and away. And I'll walk it if I need to. My elbow opens so I don't pop his arm while I'm getting on, and now I hit into it. Make sense, guys? Your feet have to switch, okay? So you're gonna start with your right hand, either cupping the shoulder or cupping or grabbing the gi. Left hand is a C clamp on the tricep, and you're pulling and you're pinching, okay? So that when you get here, you're gonna rotate so that you're pulling his arm kind of out of the socket. Here, I can't step over this one. I have to move that foot right there, and it's gonna push me up. And, and that's where you get that, that, okay? Available also. That, that, all kinds of stuff, okay? But notice it's a lot of feet, yeah. When you're moving like that, how are you breathing? Through my nose, in through the nose, out through the nose. Are you just blowing or are you trying to? Well, I never blow, so you know, <laughs> but I'm just breathing. Okay, for the record. I'm just, I'm just, you're just into the nose, out to the mouth. I guess I'm blowing out to the mouth, never in. Into the nose, out to the mouth. Just like that, you know? Just cause, but what I'm, what I'm doing is, is that uh, for me it's automatic. So I, I maybe don't, don't notice it. But what I want to do is I, at the same time, I want to make it miserable for him down here. So when you get here, okay, before I even start attacking, I want to, Make sure that he's feeling my way. Because it's gonna be, he's gonna move. So he'll move someone. Where would you move here? Maybe I'll mount that one. Okay. He decided what I would do. Okay, it wasn't really me. But here we're just gonna type that on. Yeah. I was messing around with that. Every time I bring the leg in to pull it up, my weight would shift back it would sit up and follow me up with it. Where do you focus on? I guess your forearm on his hip as you're going on uh, that leg over. Let's see here. No, okay. So, you're saying you did as I would this and they, would, they yeah. would come like a, so I, I didn't have as good of a weight as you, I think it's a big issue. Okay, so, so look, so I'm, I'm, I'm here. So okay. when that right leg comes back and I kind of so I'll shift my back. Yeah, you're probably doing that. To try to get the leg. And all he needs to do is just sit up. Right, okay. All right. I have my weight on him. Okay, can you sit up? <laughs> yeah, nope. Okay. You, you probably could. Yeah, nope. No? <laughs> not. So, so here, I'm gonna push myself up on him. And I look away as my leg comes over. Yeah, all, all, all my weight's on his core. And I'm controlling his hip. Yeah, and his core. Okay, let's try it. One, two, three. Good question. Good job, here. 